So the other day, I was just playing around with the application called Google Play Games for PC. I was testing out a few games here and there, uh, and I noticed some unusual thing. I think Google is cooking something with the Google Play Games for PC. Just in case, if you don't know what Google Play Games for PC is, it's a official Android emulator for PC, which lets you play Android games on a PC. It's official official from Google. And there are many Android games that you can play officially on your Windows PC. There are really popular games like Clash Royale, Clash of Clan, Free Fire, and many. So the other day I opened this application, I saw this game. This is called Delta Force. This is a new game. You may have seen some advertisement about this game. This is available for both PC and Android, the mobile phones. And since this is a Android emulator, you know, it lets you play Android games on a PC. I was like, what? Now I can kind of play lightweight version of Delta Force on a PC, like the Android version. Let's download it and I downloaded it and I noticed it's a little bit different than the other Android games. It's actually not a Android game. It's a PC game. Again, as I said, this game is available for both PC and mobile phones. It's available for PC through Steam. Uh, you know, the Steam. Steam is a really popular platform for gamers. You can download, purchase games and play games. You have the library and all that. It is the most popular software for gaming. The Google Play games on mobile device, the Android phones is kind of same thing. Now this app, Google Play games is now also available for PC, which does the same thing as it does on mobile phones. It lets you manage your games, lets you download games, lets you sync your achievements and everything. The main focus of this application is to let you play Android games on a PC. Officially, there are key maps and whatnot. Again, as I said, there are many Android games that you can play, but there are some games that aren't actually the Android games. For example, the Delta Force is not a Android game, okay? And there is one more example, actually. I think Genshin Impact on Google Play Games is also not a Android game. I'm just guessing here, maybe Google is also trying to make gaming platform for PC too, just like Steam, okay? Uh, again, Steam is the most popular platform for gamers on PC, but there are a couple of competitors. I think the most popular one after the stream is the Epic Games, which I also actually use because I get the free games every week, I think. Yeah, uh, it's been a while. I haven't actually touched Epic Games. So Epic Game is also kind of successful, actually. The Epic Games store became popular because of the Fortnite. I mean, Fortnite still to this date is a really popular game. So now maybe Google is also trying to do the same thing. For now, what I have noticed is that the PC games that are available on Google Play Games are actually also available for Android. So not all PC games are here yet. So maybe in future, Google will also allow you to download and play PC games too, alongside Android games. Now, there are a couple of interesting things about the PC games that you download from Google Play Games. The shortcut name, like for example, this, yeah, I'm gonna open this here actually. The Delta Force, I downloaded this thinking that it is a Android game, which turned out, no, it's not a Android game, it's a PC game. It has GPG at the end, which basically means Google Play Games. If you download this from the Steam, it's just gonna say Delta Force. So they are also separating you know, where the game was downloaded by adding the title of the place where you downloaded, I guess, the Google Play Games, GPG. Okay, so if I go here, you can see this is a exe file. Okay, so this is not an Android game, but it is available in my library here. You can see Delta Force, 50 gigabyte. I also did a Google search. What is the size of Delta Force in PC? Yes, it's 50 gigabyte. There is no way the game for Android is 50 gigabyte. They are like two to five gigabyte maximum. So 50 gigabyte is just too much for the Android game. So what I'm thinking is that 
all the cross-platform games might also become available on Google Play games. Like right now we have with the Delta Force, okay? And uh, Genshin Impact, the games that are available in multiple platforms will be available here on Google Play games for PC to download, but it's not going to be a Android game. It's going to be a PC game basically. So maybe alongside Android games, maybe they're also trying to build up the PC gaming platform thingy just like steam maybe i don't know yeah maybe google is cooking something here maybe they are also trying to do something for the pc gamers and this is going to be interesting actually you'll be able to you know download and play uh, the both android and pc games from one application again as i said this is not confirmed by anybody i'm just giving my opinion based on a few things here because there are a couple of pc games available here so maybe, again, Google is cooking something. Maybe it will only be limited to the multi-platform games. If anything too crazy happens, like some significant changes happens to the Google Play games for PC, I'll let you guys know. I'll make an update video. Okay, for now, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. But if you still have any questions or have any suggestions for me, you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too. Yeah, that's it. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.